Hello again, everyone. Welcome back, and you're welcome for that intro. I bet you liked it a little better than some of them. We're here with B.I. Hay today and the Summerfest 2022 six and a quarter by 54 Toro Extra. There's your density. Also, in the lead in, it talked about an unfinished foot. There it is. You got a, you got about three fourths of an inch or so of only wrapper, uh, or, or excuse me, only binder and filler. And you'll get those flavors before you get to the wrapper, which starts right here. Now the summer vest line dates back to 2000 and 10 and they yeah hey, just like always doesn't give blend information on this year's cigar but previous versions have been nicaraguan puros with a corojo 99 wrapper and it looks like visually that's what this one should be the uncovered foot is rather unique and i don't know how much uh, uh it, it, it lends to the interest of the cigar but it is interesting to get the flavors of the binder and filler before the wrapper hits so let's get right to it the new viaje summerfest 2022 I can tell you from experience after having these and anything like this this is a concept that does work you will notice a lot of difference in this part of the cigar and when it gets to the wrapper. I guess I'll break it down for you, but. All right, draws good. But it's going to happen so fast because that's going to burn quickly. And you'll see whenever I uh, light it up. And let's let's check the lighter. It's getting low. Not out. Now, the, the because it's just filler and uh, binder it does kind of burn a little wanky so it'll catch up and even out whenever the uh whenever it hits the wrapper but right now you've got pretty much a very tangy sweet citrus brown sugar and a little citrus peel those are your primary notes now we're going to be changing just ever so slightly here in just a minute at the wrapper there's just a touch of the binder left right there it's, it's just starting to even up and it will but your extra flavor based on the wrappers contribution is leather so those are your starting flavors and then once you hit the wrapper, you have the sweet tangy orange citrus, brown sugar, citrus peel, and leather. Black pepper at about seven and a half. It's pretty nice. So um, in my book, that's a good start. And it's an interesting start always with an unfinished foot. But it does give you a lot of insight into what the guts of the cigar taste like. first third and like I said it evened out with the burn now your notes are just like I just said before uh, there is a nice split between the leather and the sweeter notes they uh 
probably close to even, which is good because leather, too much leather, just takes away from the cigar uh, for me. But this has a lot of sweet notes, the tangy orange citrus, and brown sugar and citrus peel, which is not a sweet note, but it's not leather either. You get the notes in this order. You get this the sweet citrus and brown sugar right up front, and then close behind that is more or less a mix of the citrus peel and leather. And they're about an even amounts. Medium bodied finish is a leather with good lingering black pepper. But a cigar is very good if you like sweet with your leather. I'm rating the first third 93. I like it. Come on, boy, hey, hold in there. second third and the notes are about the same but now the percentages have shifted to more leather it's obvious that there's more leather in cigar but it's not to the point where it's uh, really hurting it a lot finish is still leather and very good lingering black pepper now medium to full body so you still got your sweet citrus and brown sugar but the scale is now tilted a little bit toward the leather or more leather 92 for the second third still good but uh, and i like it it's just that the leather is shifted so we still got a third to go and it's really coming down to that final third is it going to go full-blown leather and just fall off or is it going to maintain so let's see the end so let's wrap it up well it kind of bounced back i was surprised there's a lot of citrus and brown sugar there's even cinnamon in the mix and get this the leather has toned down and there's black coffee now at the base nutmegs in there but you won't notice it much it's in the very middle between the sweet notes and the darker notes it's not a lot Finish is actually citrus and leather with very good lingering black pepper. The black pepper on the front end is probably at eight. It's ticked up as we've gone along. So the cigar is at least gotten back the way it was in the first third. So I'm going to go back to 93 for the final third. I like it. And what a burn time. One hour and 52 minutes. Whew. That's a good one. That's good. Your overall score is 92.67. Very good in recent reviews for Biaje with me. I like this cigar a lot. I think you will too. If you look around, you can still find them. Be a little diligent and you can you can find it. So there you have it. The new Biaje Summerfest 2022. 92.67.